Uh, hello, viewers. Welcome back to Boy State. Uh, right now, I wanted to show you how uh, we can still do cascading uh, questions uh, in Cobol Toolbox, but this one is a bit, <laughs> it's going to be hard. Yeah, so the same ways we are, we are doing the, the other one, we did our previous uh, video. It's what we are going to do right now. Uh, first of all, I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to share my screen. Okay. Yeah, so these are the questions uh, we are going to create. Uh, let me first take a view and I see how best it's going to be. View. Yeah, so I want like, uh, if I select uh, Kenya, it brings me a region, regions of Kenya, whereby we have Nairobi, Central, Coast, Eastern, Northern, Nyanza, River, Lift Valley, and then Eastern. So when I click on Nairobi, it should bring me uh, towns in Nairobi. And when I click on the town, it, it should bring me the municipality. Hope you can see this. So if I click on Central, it should be bring me towns in Central, then uh, the, uh, the villages, the same thing. So when I click on Uganda, it should bring me the regions in Uganda, Northern Uganda, Eastern, Western and Southern. Then when I click on Northern, it should bring me towns in Northern. When I click on towns, it bring me the municipality. Yeah, so let's go on uh, my Excel, my Excel sheet. Uh, what I did here, uh, let me try to expand. What I did as usual, I had to make the settings here. You have to have the list name, you have to have the name, the label, the country. Uh, I mean, we can first stop here. Let me just explain this. Let me just explain this. Okay. So first of all, we have our names. We have our names. And uh, then we have our regions. We have our regions. These are regions. Then we have the towns. We have the towns. And then we have the municipality. Our municipality with our last T part we are going to, to look at. So uh, let me first unzoom it so that you can hear it very well. Hope you can see this. Yeah, so what we, what we want to do, we want to now bring in our country. I'm going to highlight this to a different thing, which can be viewable. Okay, let me use red, yellow. So we, we, we need to come to our country so that once I click the country, it brings me, uh, once I click the country, this is our country here, it brings me to a region uh, of a certain country. So uh, we have to write a country here. We are going to type the country here and then uh, on the country, we are going to come to our regions. So once I see like Nairobi Central up to up to east, up to no up to west here, it's going to be Kenya. So you just come to your you just come to your name here. You come to your name here, then you copy Kenya. Kenya, you come and paste it until you see where Kenya stops. Kenya stops here at Lift Valley. No, at West. It stops at West. So you just come to your name, copy Kenya. You just copy, then you come and paste it. You paste it here. Copy and paste. And paste. Then you drop it up to up to there. Then when we come to Western Uganda, Western Uganda, uh, you just come to Uganda on the name, you copy Uganda, then you come and paste it here, 
then you drag. Hope you can see this. So that means that once I click on Kenya, it is going to bring me the regions of Kenya. And then once I press Uganda, it is going to bring me the regions in Uganda. However, after the regions, we have the towns. So in the towns, we also have Nairobi, Coast, Eastern, what? There are very many towns up to here. So how are we going to bring the town? So that when I click maybe on Nairobi, it brings me different towns. What we're going to do, we're also going to bring the region. We are going to create a comb of the region. And in the region, we are going to come where the, where the country stopped. Where the country stopped. Now this, this is going to be a column of, of towns. So how are we going to do this? I want, to, when I take Kenya, it brings me to uh, region is, I mean the region is in Kenya. And once I click any region in Kenya, it brings me to uh, the town in Kenya. So what we're going to do still, we're going to come to our name, then we come to regions. Like for example, I have Nairobi as a region. So I'll come to a region and then I come where the town is, it's where I will start from. So I'll do the same thing the way I've done. Uh, so here you have to be knowing the regions in, in a country, like maybe in Kenya, when I say that uh, a country is Kenya, then a region is Nairobi, but still a town is also Nairobi. So that's what I've done here, Nairobi, Nairobi. Then Kakamega, I've said it is in a region of coast. Nakuru, it is in Eastern, Kisumu, Northeastern, Mombasa, Central, Eldot, Nyanza, and then up to uh, Ukunda, which is in West, Western. I've also gone to Kampala. I have Mbala, Kampala, Mbalala, Lila, Alua, Futipoto, Hoima, Lukunjiri, and Soloti. So I've said Kampala is in South, Southern Uganda. I've said Mbalala is in Western. I've said Lila is in Northern. Alua is in Northern. Futipoto is in Western. Uh, Hoima, Western. Lukunjiri, Western. Soloti, Eastern. Then, after that, we need to, like when once I click on the town, it should bring me to the municipality. So we are going now to create another law of, of town. So that town takes us to municipality. So uh, LDOT, I've said it is in Nairobi, which is uh, a what? Which is a town now. Now we're going to, to tackle on the towns. We shall tackle on the town to get the municipality. So uh, Eldot, Nairobi, Embu, Nairobi, Galisa, Ukunda. So basically you're going to just go like that. You get, you copy maybe like uh, Lila. Once you want maybe Lila to come and appear maybe on, on Soloti, you just come to Soloti here, the way it is here. Then you come here and you paste it like that. Hope you can see this. So after all that, we are going to highlight our, we are going to highlight our, our tool, the way it is. And once you highlight it, you're going to just copy and paste. Here we have copied. So after copying, just come back to your Kobo, your Kobo toolbox. And then and then you'll just come and, and do and do the pasting. Let's assume that maybe let me just get a new tool, not that one we have been learning from. So let me just put it on F F F D D tool. So I, I'm just going to come and edit. This is an empty, an empty tool. And then I come to insert cascading, cascading select. Hope you can read this. Insert cascading select. So I'm going to click there. They are going to bring uh, this empty space. Let me show you something. Once I just type this, you're saying paste your formatted table from Excel in the box below. So this is not allowed. Remember, I copied, I copied the other side. Copied. So what I'm going to do, just press Control V. Control V means copy, or else 
or else you can just place in the middle, place your right, uh, right click your mouse, then you come to paste. Once you click on paste, still it will be the same thing. So after that, you're going to come and place done. You place done. So once you place done, the questions automatically appear here. So once they appear here, you can even take your time and edit. So once I come here, maybe I can say maybe what country, what country will you, will you come? you come from. Then here I can say which region, which region, which region do you, do you come, do you come from. Then here I can say what is your hometown, what is your your home, your hometown. Then here I can easily come and say, what is your municipality? Then here, I think that's the end of the question. However, you remember to come to your settings. Now like here, uh, on the data column name, what is your home, what is the country? What country do you come from? Here you can just say, you can just say country. Reason being, they have to be the same. They have to be the same as this one is here. We have country, we have region, we have town. So uh, secondly, you come to your, to your region, still you do the same thing. Uh, which region do you come from? You just make it region. Then we also have, uh, that is region, we also have hometown. So you just say town, town. And then I think that will be all after the municipality. You just name it municipality. You can make your questions mandatory if you want, and then you can save. So let's see what we have been discussing, if it is real. Once I come to preview form, you just come here, preview form. And uh, once I click preview form, let us give it a second. Uh, you're going to see it has just brought the other first question. What country do you come from? I have Kenya. I have Uganda. Then I have, which region do you come from? There's no option here. What is your home country? There's no option. And what is your municipality? There's no option. That means that once I click any of this country, it is going to bring all those details. For example, I click Kenya. Once I click Kenya, it has brought me, uh, it has answered for me which regions do you come from. It has brought all those regions. So uh, what is your hometown? It has remained blank. What is your municipality? It has remained blank. So once I click on I lobby, once I click and I lobby, it will answer only the town part. So, and once I click on the I lobby part, it will bring me the other, uh, the other options. So let me go to Uganda. Once I click Uganda, and then I go maybe to Western Uganda, it will bring me the uh, towns in Western Uganda, whereby Balala, Futipoto, Hoima, Rukunjiri are uh, towns in Western Uganda. Once I click Hoima, it will bring me uh, Busia, Jinja, Mbale, and other uh, other options. Once I click Rukunjiri, it will bring me Ushenyi, Fotipoto, Kabale, Masindi. So guys, uh, basically this is how you can do this question. You can come in uh, your project, you name it maybe Advanced, Advanced Cas Cascade, Scaling lessons, then scaling lessons. Then after that, after that, you can come to save. Once you save your form, you can even go ahead. You can go ahead and deploy it. It is under it is under draft. So you can even deploy your form. 
you deploy your form so that maybe you can go there and start collecting the data. So uh, guys, let me hope that for those who have been asking me how to do cascading questions, how to select a country, uh, districts, municipalities, villages, please, you have got the answer. Liam, let me hope you have got the answer. And uh, guys, let us subscribe to this channel because this channel is bringing more, 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 more videos which are very helpful to you guys. Let us like, let us comment, and let us share to our friends because why would you be selfish to just maintain this video alone? Why would you watch this video alone? Share it to your friends so that they can also learn something. Otherwise, I wish you well. Bye for now. Uh, see you in our next videos at Go use it. Bye.